People across the area are getting ready for Thanksgiving, but some may not have as much to give thanks for. As Zach Gaiman reports, many food pantries throughout the area are seeing an increase in demand. As more and more people feel the effects of the economy, they're having to turn to places like the First Baptist Church in Bowling Green. Average see about uh, 50 to 60 families a month. Rodney Vincent is the Minister of Education and Administration for the church. He says, surprisingly, there are still a lot of donations coming into the food pantry. Our folks here are very generous, and we have been able to provide assistance to many people within the community because of their belief of, and love for people, uh, concern for others. This seems to be the norm all over the area. Charity Parish with the Community Action of Southern Kentucky says while the money's still tight, more and more people are able to get assistance because of this region's generosity. It's definitely a unique community that we live in and so many people want to give. But despite that giving, Parish does admit the demand is still higher than the supply. And it's not just food people need help with. The needs are high. We've had a lot of people coming in for the home energy assistance. Vincent says he just hopes people will continue to be this generous. Every month he sees more and more new faces. For some people it is a difficult thing to walk in the door and to ask. And, and, the, and they communicate that to us, that they're very sorry that they have to do that. Many organizations throughout the area are constantly taking donations. If you'd like to donate, the easiest way is to call and ask where you can drop off your money or items. In Bowling Green, Zach Gammon, WBKO. Several food pantries in the area have specific times and days they give food. If you need assistance, you can call your nearest food pantry to see when it's open.